All right, buckle up drone fans, because the DJI Mini 5 Pro leaks just went from, hmm, interesting, to, okay, take my money already. Thanks to a fresh article from Drone XL spilling the spec beans and Quadro News dropping the first ever images, we now have a ridiculously detailed picture of DJI's next ultra portable flagship. It's like someone at DJI left the gift wrapping half done, and now we're peaking early. Let's start with the heart of any drone, the camera. The Mini 5 Pro is packing a one inch sensor, which in drone world is like trading your phone camera for a Hollywood cinema rig. Paired with a redesigned gimbal that can tilt a full 225 degrees, you're basically looking at angles and perspectives your old Mini could only dream of. Video wise, we're talking 4K at 120 FPS. Yes, you read that right. Buttery slow motion sunsets, silky skateboard tricks, or epic nature shots without sacrificing resolution. And the lossless zoom up to 48 millimeters means you can get up close without turning your footage into pixel soup. Sure, it's not as zoom happy as the Air 3S medium telelens, but for a mini, that's some serious reach. Here's where it gets spicy. The Mini 5 Pro will have LAR sensors up front, teamed up with the usual optical sensors to give you 360 degree obstacle avoidance. The kicker? It still works in low light. So whether you're threading through trees at golden hour or avoiding lampposts during a Twilight City shoot, the drones basically got night vision goggles. Active Track is getting a brain upgrade too. The leaks say it'll now keep up with more dynamic stuff. Think running, cycling, or that one friend who decides to jog at Usain Bolt speed. No more awkward tracking dropouts just because you move too fast. Out of the box, you're looking at 36 minutes on the standard lightweight battery. That's already impressive, but swap in the Plus battery and you're pushing 46 minutes, enough to make your SD card sweat. The trade-off? It'll tip you over the 249 gram weight limit, meaning you might lose that sub 250 gram regulation sweet spot in some countries. The leaked images show quick release propellers, finally, and dark gray motors that give it a sleek, almost stealthy vibe. Maintenance and prop swaps? Way easier now. No more fiddling like you're diffusing a tiny bomb. Leaker Jasper Ellens first whispered August 7th, but yeah, that ship has sailed. Based on how much we've already seen, the smart money says we're about a month away from DJI making it official. If these leaks hold true, the DJI Mini 5 Pro isn't just a small upgrade, it's shaping up to be the Mini to beat. Now, excuse me while I go stare at my Mini 3, it's not you, it's the one inch sensor. Let's talk about Insta360 anti-gravity. Insta360 just dropped a bomb with its new drone brand, Anti-Gravity, and it's aiming straight for DJI's crown. <laughs> this isn't competition, it's a straight up DJI killer move. And just when we thought things couldn't get more exciting, DJI's upcoming Mini 5 Pro also made headlines thanks to Jasper Ellens, who leaked the official box image. Yup, the Mini 5 Pro is coming, and the timing couldn't be juicier. But wait, Insta360 had a move of its own. Just a few days ago, drone insider Igor Bogdanov posted on X with a wild caption, Drone Insta360 anti-gravity discovered during wilderness testing. And the image? A rugged-looking prototype caught mid-adventure looking like it just finished filming a National Geographic special. Just as Jasper Ellens leaked the DJI Mini 5 Pro box, Igor Bogdanov fired back revealing Insta360's beast in wilderness testing. Who's winning this drone war? Team DJI or Team Insta360? So, what's all the buzz about? Well, imagine this. A drone that weighs less than 249 grams, that magic number that keeps you out of trouble with most regulators, shoots in 8K, gives you 360-degree capture, and lets you reframe your footage after flying, all without needing a Hollywood film crew. Yep. <laughs> Insta360 just raised the bar mid-flight. The birth of anti-gravity, not just a drone, a statement. Insta360 is taking flight with its upcoming anti-gravity drone, aiming straight at DJI's miniseries. With a compact, futuristic design and dual 360-degree cameras, it's built for effortless cinematic capture. Igor Bogdanov's sneak peek says it all. This drone means business. Would you trade stabilization for full 360 freedom? A tiny drone with massive potential. Here's where things get seriously exciting. The anti-gravity drone may be light, but it's loaded. 
We're talking 8K resolution, hot swappable batteries, a metal heatsink, front obstacle detection, and smart safety tech. It's clever and considerate, like a tech-savvy best friend. If you could reframe any moment in 360 degrees, what would you capture first? More than just specs, it's about the story. What makes the anti-gravity drone really stand out is its mission. Insta360 isn't just chasing DJI's performance metrics, they're trying to redefine aerial storytelling. This drone is built for independent creators, vloggers, cinematic storytellers, and anyone tired of the fly up, pan down, fly back routine. With 360 capture and advanced post-flight editing, it's like having a floating camera operator who never complains about long hours. And for anyone new to drones, Insta360 promises an intuitive flight experience. Whether you're a nervous first-timer or a seasoned FPV junkie, the anti-gravity aims to fly like a dream. Let's not forget, coming in under 249 grams isn't just a technical flex, it's a legal loophole lifesaver. In countries like the US, drones under 0.55 pounds, about 249 grams, don't need registration for recreational use. That's fewer headaches, no red tape, and more time doing what you love, flying and creating. So basically, you get a high-end drone with pro features and you can skip the paperwork? Yes, please. Will it knock DJI off the throne? That's the million dollar question. DJI currently controls around 70% of the drone market, but Insta360 has a proven track record of shaking things up. By fusing next level camera tech with clever drone engineering, they may have just carved out a new niche. And if the price lands close to DJI's Mini 5, well, <laughs> DJI might wanna buckle up. So what's it gonna be? The tried and true DJI Mini or this daring new anti-gravity disruptor? Either way, it's a great time to be a drone fan. Let's talk about DJI Neo 2. Buckle up creators, DJI just dropped a bombshell. Two brand new gadgets have just hit the FCC radar. The DJI Neo 2 drone and the Osmo Mobile 8 gimbal. That's right, 2025 isn't slowing down and neither is DJI. Whether you're chasing cinematic drone shots, mastering buttery smooth phone footage, or just capturing your dog's epic zoomies in 4K slow-mo, this might be the camera shakeup you've been waiting for. The DJI Neo 2, a small drone with big energy like. Let's start with the big bird in the room, the DJI Neo 2. This bad boy just got certified for sale in the US, which means, say what? It's officially real and no longer just another juicy rumor drifting through Reddit threads like a digital tumbleweed. No way, it's coming and soon. The Neo 2 was seen in public testing this spring, just casually hanging out next to the rumored Avidaw 3, like a younger sibling tagging along to the cool kids club. Cute, right? But don't be fooled, this thing has beast mode activated. Under the hood, it's rocking an 11.6 watt hour battery. That's about 10.7% more juice than the original DJI Neo, which already offered 18 minutes of flight. So what does that mean? Longer shots, more time in the air, and maybe enough battery life to survive your overambitious mountain reveal shot without crash landing in a lake. Keyword here though, maybe. DJI, stop teasing us. Flight time hasn't been confirmed yet. My patience is on life support. But let's dream for a sec. Buttery cinematic flyovers, extended FPV chases, and maybe even time for a last minute dramatic swoop before your drone whispers battery low and yeets itself toward the earth. Oh no! And hey, price-wise, the original Neo is sitting pretty at $289 on Amazon. If DJI keeps the Neo 2 anywhere close to that price tag, it's gonna fly off the shelves faster than a drone in sport mode. Yes. DJI is not just dipping a toe into the 360 pond, they're diving in headfirst with goggles on. Until then, we'll sit tight with our popcorn and check for leaks like it's a Netflix cliffhanger. So what's the takeaway? DJI is not just launching products, they're launching dreams.